for our next uh, vlog, my Filipino wife had the idea that uh, McDonald's and KFC and a and W is just not exciting enough for her. <laughs> so we're going to do a little bit of food exploring around Langley, see what we can find that's uh, of a bit more interest and variety. Yeah, and before we start, we would like to do a shout out to some of our subscribers back in the Philippines. Shout out to Angel Santa Maria 27. Thank you and hello to you. Thank you for subscribing. And to Edna Menya as well. Thank you so much for always sharing our videos. And of course, thank you to all our subscribers from all over the world, especially in the Philippines. Cebu, Mayang Buntag, Mayang Hapon, Mayang Gabi, Irin yung Tanan din ha. Also, hello to Madeline, Aljon, and family. Hello! And to our subscribers from Hong Kong, my Uncle Jeff and Joanne. Hello to you guys. And thank you to everybody for subscribing and supporting us. We really appreciate it. Yes, we do. Okay, so now we're hungry, so let's go and let's, let's eat. eat. Sign up on a list for us to get inside. So we're just waiting for a text to get in. Super excited to give them a try. If it's this busy all the time, can't wait to see what the food is like. Excited to me, guys. Thank you. Yeah. Are you excited to try? I am. I got a tiramisu cappuccino. Uh, it the chocolate's got a little bit of a burnt flavor to it, I guess. Mm. Um, I'm not really a cappuccino drinker very much, so it's hard for me to make a huge comparison, but it's got a, a light flavor to it. It's not overly strong. done but not overly cooked. It's very good. Very happy. The smoked salmon on top gave this French toast a really interesting twist. Plus the sweetness of the maple syrup just balanced everything out. This is our day two of Langley brunch hunt. But before anything else, we have to attend to a very special appointment. So we'll take care of that first and then we'll eat.
top number two, Spotted. Cinnamony? Very cinnamon <laughs> Let's try the burger. This will be the first time I've ever had a hamburger with an egg on it, so it's very rare for me. Oh, it's thick. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. <laughs> I'm trying to get my mouth around it. <laughs> it's so big. It's big. It's dripping too. Is it good? Hmm. It's a fresh hand pressed burger, so it's homemade. It's not a frozen burger. It's got some nice cheese on it. Rich and creamy. Hits the spot. Very good. <laughs> well, I love matcha, so there's no question here. <laughs> <laughs> The combination of the creaminess of the tuna and the melted cheese is so delicious. But what made this dish a winner was the huge portion of fresh fruit on the side. It was so good. The clubhouse sandwich here comes with large juicy chicken breast that really hit the spot. However, I wish I had chosen the fruit over the fries for my side. Sure. <laughs> Try to figure a way to attack it first. <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> My mouth doesn't open wide enough. Late update. <laughs> Are you still okay? <laughs> That's coming home with me. <laughs> Tap on. What I loved about this matcha donut is that it is not overly sweet. And I paired it with their freshly squeezed lemonade and oh, it was perfect.
one small chicken noodle soup, please. Oh, that's right. Oh, so that's Naomi. Yeah, yeah, okay, that's what you want? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Sorry. Just like twice. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry about that. <laughs> smoothie is what you actually need on a hot day like today. This reminded me of home. Okay. This ham and cheese sandwich was really filling. I paired it with our tomato soup and it is so good too. But what I really loved about this is the softness and the freshness of their bread. If you're looking for a place that does home-style comfort foods right, then I think you owe it to yourself to come on down to Cubans and give them a try. I don't think you're going to be disappointed when you do. So there you have it. That's our top five brunch places here in Langley. What do you think? That was good. I had a good time. We get to see some places we haven't been before. Yeah, <laughs> I had a great time myself too. And that's a different um, experience for me because, you know, we Filipinos love our rice so much. Breakfast pa lang, diba guys? Breakfast, lunch, dinner, snacks, midnight snacks. <laughs> There's we a lot of rice eating when you're married to a, a Filipino or an Asian. I guarantee you guys. But you like it too. I do, I do. All right. So, and again, with that experience, I was able to try out different um, variety. So yeah, we got to try out a few different things. Uh, you know, and we got to support some small businesses that may mm -hmm. have been struggling over the course of this That's last true. year and a half. So that was a, a, a benefit to what we were doing. We yeah. enjoyed that. We enjoyed that part as well. And if you guys like our video, please give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel too. Uh, hit the notification bell and please leave us some comments. Let us know how, what you thought and uh, if there's anything you'd like to see in the future. Have a wonderful day. Right, take care and we'll see you on our next one. Bye. Bye. One of Trent's friend too, so friends is French. <laughs> yeah. So that was the wrap up for our five stops for our brunch hunt in Langley. What do you think? Oh, I had a great time. How about you? I get the itchy nose. <laughs> <laughs> Ha <laughs> <laughs>